Welcome to TT, the Go Anywhere platform built for professional traders. In this video, we'll show you how to build a workspace, place an order, and review your activity in the TT platform. After logging in, we'll launch a blank workspace by clicking on the Create Another Workspace button. Give the workspace a name and click the Save button. Then, launch it by clicking on the button containing the name of our new workspace. This launches a blank workspace in a new browser window. We'll add some of the most commonly used widgets and demonstrate how a TT's new search functionality can be used to add instruments. If you don't know the product symbol, you can type the product name in the search box, either at the top of the window or within the widget. Let's search for NYMEX crude oil and launch a market grid for the CL Futures product by clicking the market grid icon directly in the search results. This launches a market grid widget displaying market data for all CL Futures instruments. Let's enable single click order entry by launching TT's static price ladder MD Trader from the widgets drop down menu and populate the ladder with the February NYMEX crude oil futures contract. We now know the product symbol is CL, so let's type that in the search box and select the February 16 contract. And we'll add a tab to MD Trader for the February Brent crude oil futures contract. Next, let's launch a chart widget and attach it to the MD Trader widget by holding the Control Shift keys and dragging until the colored edges match up. We now have a widget group. We'll launch a time and sales widget and add it to the widget group. The chart and the time and sales will display data for whichever contract is selected in the tabbed MD Trader. Now, we'll quickly open an order book widget to view working orders and take a moment to arrange our widgets. We'll add an audit trail to view all trade activity, a fills widget to view the fills, and a position widget to view positions and PL. We'll again arrange those widgets to make the best use of screen space. Once all of the widgets are positioned where you want them, save the workspace by clicking on the icon in the top right window. Now that we have built our workspace, let's place an order. In the market grid, click in the bid quantity, bid, ask, or ask quantity columns to open an order ticket for a particular contract. We'll adjust the price and place a buy order off the market. You will see the order in the order book as well as our MD Trader widget, and you will see the execution report in the audit trail. Let's change the price of the working order to cross the market. Highlight the order in the order book, modify the price of the order to the ask price, and click the change button. Since the order is now filled, it will disappear from the order book. You will see the execution report in the audit trail and fill information in the fills widget. You will also see your position and PL in the positions widget. For more information, see our online help at tradingtechnologies.com. Stay tuned for additional demonstrations.